The Maramano Abrazese Sheepdog or Marema Sheepdog, usually referred to simply as the Maramano or Abrazese Sheepdog, is a breed of livestock guardian dog indigenous to central Italy and the northern parts of southern Italy, particularly to Abruzzo and the Marema region of Tuscany and Lazio, it has been used for centuries by Italian shepherds to guard sheep from wolves. The literal English translation of the name is the dog of the shepherds of the Marema and Abrazese region. The English name of the breed derives from that of the Marema marshlands where, until recently, shepherds, dogs and hundreds of thousands of sheep overwintered and where the breed is today abundant, although sheep herding has decreased substantially. The breed is widely employed in Abruzzo, where sheep herding remains vital to the rural economy and the wolf remains an active, though protected, predator. Similar-looking dog breeds include the Pyrenean Mountain Dog, known as the Great Pyrenees in North America, the Kuvis of Hungary, the Polish Tatra Sheepdog, the Slovensky Kuvak of Slovakia and the Sarplaninak, with all of which it may share a common ancestor and the Akbash of Turkey. The Abruzzi Shepherd Maremma resembles a polar bear, which is why it seems harsh and involuntarily instills fear. However, the first impression is deceiving. Indeed, the representatives of the breed have a difficult character, but their owners believe that there is no better family friend than the Marema. Let's figure out what these dogs fascinate people with. Highlights The breed is considered rare and not distributed everywhere. Most of all, Marema is appreciated by farmers in Italy, USA, Australia and Canada. The independent character of the animals is the result of many years of working breeding with minimal communication with humans. In Australia, since 2006, Marema Abruzzi Shepherd dogs have been attracted to the protection of populations of blue penguins and wombats. You should not start a Marema if your house is constantly open for big noisy companies and new acquaintances. Representatives of this family do not favor outsiders, mistaking them for a potential threat. Shepherd dogs are not hyperactive and do not need intense sports loads, but it is difficult for them to adapt to life in an apartment. The breed is not created for official work and complete submission. The Marema Abruzzo Shepherd dogs perceive the owner as an equal companion, whose opinion is not always worth listening to. Maremas have a very developed craving for guardian activities, therefore, in the absence of sheep, the dog guards children, poultry and even small decorative pets. The snow-white coat of the Marema Abruzzo Shepherd dog almost does not smell like a dog, even if it gets wet. The exception is unkempt, painful individuals. There are from six to nine puppies in a Marema litter. History of the Marema Abruzzo Sheepdog Breed The Marema Abruzzo Sheepdog got its name thanks to two historical regions of Italy, Marema and Abruzzo. For a long time, the regions were arguing among themselves for the right to be considered the homeland of dogs. But since the conflict dragged on and there was no preponderance in either direction, the dog handlers had to compromise and write both regions in the name of the breed. As for the first mentions of gigantic white-haired shepherd dogs, they are easy to find in the works of the ancient Roman authors Rutilius Palladius and Lucius Columella. Describing the peculiarities of farming in the territories of the Eternal City, both researchers noted white dogs that are dexterous in grazing and driving sheep. Sculptures and frescoes depicting the first Maremmas have also survived. Check out the ancestors of today's shepherd dogs at the Capu Archaeological Museum, the British Museum, look for the figure named Jennings Dog Duncombe's Dog, the Church of Santa Maria de Novella in Florence, and the San Francesco Temple in Amatrice. If you happen to visit the exhibition of paintings from the Vatican Pinacotec, be sure to find the painting Christmas by the medieval painter Mariotto di Nardo, the Marema Abruzzo sheepdog is depicted on it very realistically. They began to register the breed in herd books in 1898, at the time of the procedure, only four individuals were issued documents. In 1924, the animals received their first standard of appearance, drawn up by Giuseppe Solaro and Luigi Grappi, but later, until 1940, shepherd dogs were no longer involved in registration. It is worth paying attention to the fact that until the middle of the 20th century, dogs from Marema and dogs from Abruzzo were positioned as two independent breeds. This was explained by the fact that historically individuals from these regions very rarely contacted each other, developing in isolation. The mixing of phenotypes occurred only during the drive of cattle across the country, the shepherd dogs accompanied the sheep, entered into contact with dogs from other regions, and produced mestizo puppies along the way. The union of the breed clans into one family, called the Marema Abruzzo Shepherd Dog took place only in 1958, at the insistence of the same Giuseppe Solaro. Marema Abruzzo Sheepdog Breed Standard Marema is a solid, but by no means overweight blonde, inspiring respect with his impressive noble appearance. External nervousness and feigned suspicion are not inherent in the breed, therefore the expression of the muzzle in shepherd dogs is more concentratedly attentive than stern. The physique of the representatives of this family is moderately stretched, but at the same time balanced. 
Males are noticeably larger and heavier than bitches. The standard height of a thoroughbred boy is 65 to 73 centimeters, weigh 35 to 45 kilograms. Girls weigh 30 to 40 kilograms with a height of 60 to 68 centimeters. Color. The ideal Marema is a dog with snow white hair. It is undesirable, but it is permissible to have areas on the body colored in ivory or in light red and yellowish lemon. The nature of the Marema Abruzzo Shepherd. Do not confuse the security activity of the Marema with the working technique of the wolfhound. Historically, the breed was bred to scare away enemies from the herd, there was never any talk of engaging in a fight with predators and thieves who decided to feast on free lamb. Usually the dogs worked in a group, each participant in the action had his own observation post, which helped to timely reflect the enemy's attack. Modern Marema Abruzzo Shepherd dogs retained the guardian instincts of their ancestors, which could not but leave an imprint on their character. All members of the family of today's Marema are serious and proud creatures who periodically have problems with subordination. It cannot be said that these Italians are the most difficult to educate shepherds, just unconditional obedience is not their strong point. The dog considers the man in general and the owner in particular to be equal to himself, therefore, all attempts to suppress the animal with his authority can be considered a failure. Condescendingly, the Marema Abruzzi shepherd dogs refer only to children, patiently enduring their strokes and suffocating hugs. True, such benevolence does not apply to an unfamiliar baby, so if friends with a not particularly well-bred child visit you, it is better to isolate the dog, the Marema can react to the leprosy of someone else's offspring in an unexpected way. The breed has a pretty good memory, supported by selectivity and communication. Usually, a dog peacefully greets guests who have previously appeared on the doorstep of the house and are remembered for their exemplary behavior. Strangers and family friends who previously provoked the pet into a conflict, the animal suspects of all mortal sins and scans with a markedly hostile look. Hunting habits of Maremas are absent as such, so the breed does not pose a danger to other domestic animals. Moreover, existence side by side with other representatives of the fauna awakens ancient instincts in the shepherd. As a result, the Marema begins to graze chickens, ducks, cows, and, in general, any living creatures up to penguins. Education and training. A slight detachment of behavior and an unwillingness to blindly follow the owner of the Marema were formed on purpose. Historically, contact between puppy and owner has been kept to a minimum, and individuals who have been friends with humans have often been discarded. At a month and a half, the Maremas were already planted in the sheepfold so that they would learn to protect their flock and wean from communicating with the owner. This helped to educate from the sheepdogs responsible, capable of making independent decisions, defenders, but not the most obedient campaigners. There is an opinion that the Marema Abruzzi Shepherd dogs, in principle, are not aimed at memorizing commands, so if the pet manages to develop adequate behavior to the demands to me and sit is already a great achievement. In fact, everything is not so sad. Yes, Maremas are not servicemen, and when faced with the choice to guard the territory or to race after the stick thrown by the owner, they will always choose the first option. Nevertheless, it is possible to train them. In particular, with a half-year-old puppy, you can easily complete the OKD course. The teaching methodology is the same, as for all shepherd dogs, Maremas do not need exceptions and indulgences. A very important nuance is punishment. No physical impact should be exerted, no matter how provocative the puppy may be. And the point here is not the subtle mental organization of the dog. It's just that the Marema Abruzzo sheepdog will never forgive you for a blow and will stop recognizing your authority after the very first execution. The most difficult period in the life of every owner of a Marema dog is the age of seven to nine months. This is the period of puberty when the puppy grows up and begins to infringe on the title of chief in the house. You will have to deal with a grown-up bully stricter but without assault. A short leash is effective for disciplining your pet. Training at this time is not cancelled, but is carried out in a standard mode, but with more stringent requirements. Another cure for disobedience is the demonstration of physical superiority. This approach is used only in a situation where the dog challenges the owner to open confrontation. Usually, to sober up a presumptuous animal, a push to the chest, not to be confused with a blow or a sharp jerk of the leash is enough. In articles devoted to training the breed, inexperienced owners are strongly advised to resort to the services of a professional dog handler. However, do not rush to blindly follow the recommendations. The pro will teach the Marema, of course, but she will mainly obey him, not you. If you want to get a well-bred and adequate dog, train it yourself and take your pet to classes with a dog handler a couple of times a week in order to get useful advice and correct mistakes. Maintenance and care. The Marema Abruzzo sheepdog is an open-air cage type dog. 
it is also possible to meet representatives of the breed who manage to get used to living in a city apartment, but it is important to understand that in such cases the animals simply adapt to the situation. We are not talking about any full-fledged life in cramped conditions. Ideal when the pet can move freely from home to yard and back. For life on a chain, maremmas are also not created, such restrictions break the psyche of a shepherd dog, turning it into an embittered and uncontrollable creature. The breed does not need intense physical activity, but twice a day, an adult dog needs to discharge itself on a walk. Walking the maremma is supposed to be 1.5 to 2 hours, and in any weather, so for inactive owners, the shepherd from Abruzzo is not the most suitable option. The coat of the maremma Abruzzo sheepdog is considered self-cleaning. This means that the dog is capable of getting dirty, but this condition will not radically affect its exterior. Dirt sticks to maremmas in rainy weather, while only the dog gets wet, and the undercoat remains dry and clean in any case. The coat of the breed does not stray into tangles if the dog is healthy and at least minimally looked after. A natural diet is suitable for the breed, which should be based on any lean meat and offal. Heat treatment of meat is not required, since raw animal protein is healthier for shepherd dogs. You can supplement the menu for maremma with frozen boneless sea fish, low-fat cottage cheese and yogurt. The egg can be given no more than one to two times a week. Be sure to make shavings for your pet from raw fruits and vegetables, apples, pumpkins, carrots, zucchini. These salads can be seasoned with sour cream, unrefined sunflower oil or fish oil. For cereals with meat, it is better to use buckwheat, rice, and oatmeal. A bowl of water must be freely available.